potential promo packages come in um, which is really good both companies that I've worked with before GBFKE reached out and asked if I wanted to preview some stuff as did my favourite budget company which is New Craft Day of course I have chosen wisely I have tried not to pick anything that would be a breach of copyright laws I know it's different for these companies because they're in China but for me I still like to stay true to my copyright rule um, so that's good um, other news what else have I got go I haven't got anything that I can actually tell you about I've got a couple of things I can't tell you about but I don't have anything anything should I say before Lisa picks up on the fact that uh, I've just said anything instead of anything um, so currently I am 64.88% complete but I've only actually stitched 72 stitches so far today I'm not doing good but luckily I am ahead I of course also need to break down this camera mount tonight and um, get this diamond painting ready for transportation because I'm taking it away with me I already have ocean in the car I did do I did film a kitten up video not yesterday the night before so you'll have that to look forward to at some point next week I'm obviously going to save it to go out when I when I, while I'm away on holiday um, other than that um, it's been amazing seeing everybody posting in the group and using the group it is of course Penny's group um, not mine but she has very kindly allowed me to uh, admin on there so that I can post up random memes comments <laughs> you name it anything I feel like um, <clears throat> and yes I could I could have my own group and do my own group for my channel but I haven't got time to monitor it and there's no point me, me and Penny come together so I might as well just nick hers I'm trying to find lower numbers because I don't want to be doing the bigger ones just yet Although there isn't that many of them, to be fair. So, 3021. <coughs> the other point that um, I had about these polymer pens, um, they do stay quite squishy. Now, even when they're fully cured, there's a bit of a bounce there. So, my worry was um, that I would make the pen and it would cure and someone would get it and then... As they used it, it would mould where they were holding it. But actually, after discussing this with Penny, she actually made a very good point. Surely that's a good thing. Because that means that that pen will then mould to the shape of that person's hand. And you know what? She's right. It is a good thing. So, um... I haven't yet um, done one and used sealant or varnish or anything yet. So I, I need to test that out. So there is some further testing that's going to be required. I don't want to chuck these out too soon because I've got enough on. Um, but I will be making a few more to test out. I want to try some longer ones. I want to try some thinner ones. Um, and certainly while I'm in discussions with Kat over the large tray that we're looking at doing might as well play with the polymer clay while I'm waiting um, I did order a big kilo pack 
of white. Uh, the plan being that I would then use the white as the core for each pen. Because there's no point it being a colour all the way through when um, when you don't actually need it to be. Um, and I've got some ideas. I've got some fabulous ideas. Oh, I think they're fabulous for designs. Um, I have been watching a few, quite a few, um, tutorials. Um, I was asked in the live about whether I could do a tutorial on how to make the polymer clay pen, um, but I've decided not to. At the end of the day, I'm going to make them my way. And I want that to be um, I want that to be something that I hold on to. So um, I'm not going to do that. However, if you do have any ideas, oh, what the hell have I done there? I've dropped a drill clearly. Um, if you do have any ideas of things that you might like to see, on my Etsy shop. Um, I am aware that I need to make some more cook pots. I am also aware that I need to make some more cover minders. So those ideas aside, what else would you like to see on the Kitten Up Kitten Etsy store? What would you like to see me offer? I guess is the right word. I'm going to try this again. If I'm going to start having problems with my putty, then I will refill it. Because do you know what? It's been a ball ache enough getting these videos done. I'm not going to put up with half sticky putty as well. Because seriously, my patience is wearing thin. Um, haven't got my splint on now. I have had it on today. Um, so going to do the holiday. And then when I get back, I'm going to make an appointment to see the doctor. To try and find out what this actually is. Whether it is... I've already done that one. getting ahead of myself and um, see whether it is um, arthritis or carpal tunnel or even something else um, and what the treatment options are because it is quite painful I don't want to have to give up doing nails or my cleaning job because I'm really enjoying the little cleaning job I know that sounds weird but I am I really do because I'm on my own, pretty much, doing my own thing. And uh, quite like it. <coughs> so, you know, um, I will have my, my jobs to do that day. But if I decide between one job and the next that I want to have 20 minutes before I start the next job, I can. Just do it. I might have to sort this putty out because if I'm going to do more than more than half an hour, I can't be doing with that pen. Messing me up. What are we up to? 17 minutes on this one, on this attempt. So I probably have got, you know, a good three quarters of an hour so far. So it's not the end of the world. So I'm going to take this putty out. I'm going to leave the single place that I actually did already do before I went live because it was looking very low before I went live, before I started filming. See, don't even know what I'm doing. Past knowing what I'm even doing. So I'm just going to make sausage. All about sausages in this house, aren't we? 
and then pop that in there. I also need to say thank you to those subscribers that have been mentioning us in lots of different places. So I was introduced to the lovely Pebbles Diamond Painting by Penny the other day. So hello Pebbles if you are watching. Thank you for mentioning the event. I also need to mention Kim. Because Kim got the event name called out on Admiral Zest, which is phenomenal because, as you know, if you're in the UK, um, Rebecca is the largest, as far as I'm aware, um, UK YouTuber that does diamond painting. So to get our hashtag on there is amazing. So thank you, Kim. You're such a star. And I still think you should start your own YouTube channel. Just saying. Because I need someone else to watch. I um, also need to put a shout out to Claire. Nerdy uh, Diamond Painter. Is it Nerdy Diamond Painter? <laughs> How ill-prepared am I? Diamond Painting Nerd. So the lovely Claire has been um, obviously films quite far in advance. Because I'm watching videos now where she's talking about starting the event. And of course, we're nearly at the end. So thank you, Claire, for giving us a mention. Um, oh, there's so many of you. You're all bloody fab. You really are. I couldn't wish for better subscribers, put it that way. And do you know what? I'm creeping up. Um... I had a goal when I very first started doing YouTube and um, the goal was that we just needed to have more British diamond painters. That was it. And I had a goal where I thought, do you know what? Let me get to 100. If I get to 100, I'll be happy. And I got to 100 and then it was like, right, OK, so I'll get to 300. I'll be happy. Well, actually, it was 250. So I've done pretty much a, a sub giveaway at 100, 250, 500 and 750. Um, and each time I've done it, I have been absolutely amazed to get there. And... Um, it's phenomenal it's phenomenal guys and do you know what as a youtuber other creators will know this your numbers can fluctuate quite a lot now of course there are people out there whose numbers shot up right from the word go it's took me a little bit longer but i think that's probably because i am kind of you know <laughs> i'm not the professional person i'm not I'm not that professional YouTuber with all the posh voice and everything. You know, it is what, what it is. <laughs> I am what I am. Um, so I didn't expect to get that many. So the fact that I'm actually only just over 200 away from a 1,000 subscribers. So of course, of course, I need to, uh, I need to do a giveaway. For a thousand subscribers of course I will um, so um, you know if you you know if you think that that YouTube is easy it's not you know, it starts off as being easy you know you're just sitting there you're diamond painting and you're chatting while you do it that bits easy What's not easy is as you get bigger and as people, you start to talk to people and get comments from people and they will go, oh, you know, why don't you do this? And, oh, no, I'd really love to see this. And, oh, no, why don't you try this company? And before you know it, it is kind of a job. It is kind of work in a way because the prep that you have to do gets so long and do you know what youtube just recently for uploading has been a bloody ball lake 
don't think I've actually got that many colours left, you know, guys. It's looking like I'm um, getting down to the last few. Um, so, yeah, it, it can be, and certainly at this point. So I do intend to do a 1,000 subscriber giveaway. If you would like to help me get to a 1,000 subscribers, here's how you help like my videos the more people that like my videos the more often that they will be um recommended to other viewers that is that is a fact that's how it works if you are you know talking to other diamond painters on different groups etc you know, if it's allowed, then, you know, when they turn around and they say things like, oh, where can I get trays from? Mention Kitten Up Kitten. When someone says, who knows, um, YouTubers to watch, mention Kitten Up Kitten. All of those things will help me get to a thousand. And at a thousand subscribers... I will do a giveaway that will consist of a limited edition colour. And by that point, we should have a bigger tray. So it will be a three tray limited edition diamond painting cook tray. And there will only be one set, literally one set. <laughs> so um, I will give details later on on how to take part in that giveaway. But honestly, the best way you can help me get there is to talk about me, to recommend me, to like the videos, etc, etc. That's all that it takes. And very soon, I will get there. And then after a thousand, I will stop looking. Because a thousand is the magic number. It's the magic number because that's when you can start to monetize your channel. And although I have no intentions of doing subscriptions or Patreon or anything like that, it's just nice to get to that milestone. So there we go. That's how you can help. Now, in the meantime, you can, of course, get yourself ready. Maybe you have been watching myself, Penny, Oh, oh, let me get that single one down there. I've got a little one single drill right down the bottom there. Let's get that. Um, you might have been watching us on the way along and um, you've thought, oh, you know, I'd, I'd quite like to do that. I'd quite like to try a conversion. Well, do you know what? You're in luck because we're going to do this all over again in November. That's right. There will be a DIY DP November 23. Am I freaking mad or what? I'm hoping, <laughs> I'm really hoping that the amazingly gorgeous, wonderful, fantastic, amazing, beautiful Penny from Cow Sparkles is going to help me again um, because uh, it's hard work to do it. <laughs> Do it by yourself it really is um and you know what november when we did the very first one when it was pk november um we had like i don't know nine maybe eight or nine people taking part it was a fab event really good event um this time round we've had 23 including the lovely Alexandra, who has been not doing it in real, but has been coming along anyway. 
um, which do you know what why not um, so if we can improve again if we can increase again in November it is then it's really going to take off and I'd love to do this because everybody can do with a jump a little jump start into doing their conversion projects because we all know how hard it can be to keep the motivation going motor motivation not the motor nation i don't even know what that word is this is where you've got me to i don't know what i'm saying so yeah we will be back or at least i will be and the amazing beautiful wonderful helpful penelope who isn't actually very impressed with me right now because i'm going on holiday without her apparently um apparently that's that's a bit of a cheeky thing to do however can i point out that i'm only going on holiday to a little place just outside skegness penny is pissing off for two weeks to florida florida so uh just saying that's a little bit more of a a jump than i'm doing okay i think that's all of them so we just need to let's do the sevens first which is 3051 so i'm gonna have a quick break i know that is hilarious after the fact it's taken me two days to film this one video but i promise you <laughs> i will be back okay so a quick a quick jump around <laughs> or as close to jumping as i can get anyway um just to get those muscles moving because i'm not gonna lie i'm normally upstairs by now um hubby has gone to his local um we've lived here three years but obviously we moved during lockdown which meant that we weren't able can't see we weren't able to um sort of go out and try the the restaurants and the pubs and all that sort of thing and um so he's only just recently started going and uh yeah he seems to have found a pub that he really likes so because I had this to do tonight, because I didn't get it done yesterday, um, he sort of said, oh, I'm, I'm going to go have a couple. And I'm like, yeah, that's fine. Because I know damn well I can get this video done. I can edit and save these videos tomorrow while I'm travelling or while we're setting up. Um, or even first thing in the morning. Um so all I've got to do is get it filmed, pretty much. So why don't I go over what the plan is for the rest of this week, just in case you haven't seen. So these videos will be going up Saturday and Sunday as normal. Um, Sunday night, by midnight Sunday... If you're taking part, of course, um, you know, if you're if you're just watching, <laughs> don't send me don't send me pictures of your whips and stuff because it will mean nothing. And you'll you waste your time and I won't be able to fit them all in anyway. But if you're taking part in DIY DP May 23, um, where did I go? I've gone wrong to. That's a four, that's a four, that's a three. It is that one. Never take your eye off the canvas. That's that's my advice. Um, yeah, so if you are taking part by midnight BST Sunday, please check whatever time zone you're in. Um, you need to send me a picture of your whip and the amount of drills you've laid and the percentage of canvas that you've done 
on Monday, I will then do a video with the updates on and show everybody's work and where they're up to at that point. On Tuesday, there will be a live, as always, hosted by Penny because I am away in the caravan. So for safety circumstances, because we've had issues before where I've lost signal and then it's booted everybody off, um, Penny is going to host that video so that if I do lose signal, because I don't know how good it's going to be where I'm going, it means that I can leave and rejoin and it won't affect your viewing pleasure. So that is Tuesday at 8 p.m. BST. Be there or be square. You then need to, by um, midnight Tuesday, you need to send me your final figures. You don't necessarily have to send me a whip unless you want to. If you do, I will include it, but if not, I will use the previous one. But you do need to give me your updated figures because the video on Wednesday will be announcing the winners of the categories. Now, in addition, let's explain why I need the figures that I do. There will be a prize for most drills laid over the course of that competition. So if you are one of those people that did, sorry, I've, I thought I'd highlighted one that then I didn't have. So where are we? Right, so I've done those two, those two, those three, those two. Sorry, I got confused. I got confuzzled because I'd highlighted two that I didn't need. So I've done that. Okay, let's move this back down. Sorry, got distracted. So uh, most drills. So there will be a prize for most drills laid over the course of the event. If you are one of those people that has done more, that has completed um, your project and started a new one, they will all count. Sam, turn your pen on. Oh my God. Never learn, do I? Never. Um, there will also be a prize for highest percentage completed. So again, have I gone really wrong here? That's that one, that's there. That's that one. Oh, I don't freaking know. I don't know anymore. I'm past caring. Literally, I don't know what I'm doing. Oh, okay. Okay, so that's that one. So where did that one come in? Oh, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know what I'm doing. Nothing is going right. I've made a complete cock up somewhere along the line here. So I'm going to start at the top here and try and correct it. Um, so, yes, there will be um, a prize for highest percentage over the course of this event completed. But there will also be a grand prize. So prize for most drills laid will include a limited edition tray amongst other things. Depending on where you live, you will get a quality, and we mean high quality, um, possibly Diamond Art Club, possibly other high quality companies, 
diamond painting and accessories. The same will go for the prize for most, the highest percentage. So you're guaranteed a limited edition tray. You're guaranteed at least one diamond painting, if not more. And you are guaranteed some accessories, which is fabulous. But the grand prize. Now the grand prize is voted for by you by the competitors and what you need to do is you need to choose which of the canvases that have been done by the people in this group in this event which one you like the most now it may be that you like the image it may be that um, you think that person deserves it it may be that they've gone above and beyond it may be you know, it could just be that you like that person. Whatever that reason is, I need that vote. So I need to know the name of the person you're voting for and the name of their canvas. And give me a reason why. So you can either email that to me at kittenupkitten at gmail.com, which is my standard email for queries or comments or questions or you know just to say hi how you doing why did you swear so much on your last video that sort of crap um the best way the the quickest way to a get a response from me or b get your vote in is to actually send it by message to penny's facebook group so facebook group calbs sparkles because i will see that long before i see an email very much true um and it will then mean that myself and penny i need your vote by tuesday at midnight so any time between Sunday and Tuesday is absolutely fine. And the reason for that is it gives myself and Penny time to look at who the winners will be, where they're located and what prizes you will get. Um, because we have some amazing prizes gifted from people across the world not even lying we have someone from australia we have two or three people in the states we've got in the uk me and penny have got stuff you know there's so much and um it just makes sense that if you're in the states that you would get a prize coming directly to you from somebody else in the states so um yeah, there's some amazing prizes and with a bit of luck, we can uh, orchestrate this even better for November because we didn't know that we were going to get the donations that we have. I mean, it's, it's so generous and so phenomenal. So thank you to everyone that has. But for you guys taking part, winning these, these things would be even better. Now I can reveal, the only thing I can reveal is that the main prize will include a set of limited edition trays in the pink. A set. So you will have both. Surely that's a prize in itself. That should be enough, surely. But no, we have diamond paintings. We have accessories. We have gift vouchers. It's it's phenomenal. So um, it's very exciting. Kind of wish I was in the running. Now, of course, you're voting. You cannot vote for yourself. And you cannot vote for myself or Penny. We are doing ours alongside just to encourage you guys to do it. Not to win prizes. Although Penny would say that she wants to win a prize. <laughs> she always does. But no. 
we're not included. Okay, so that's them two. So, my dear, darling subscribers, my fellow um, DIY DPers, um, I am going to call it a day on the video um, because, frankly, I'm tired <laughs> and I want to go to bed because I've got a lot to do. Um, so, you will have seen this section of the diamond painting you will probably be watching on Sunday um, I wish everybody taking part all the look in the world one final push guys one final push to uh, just realize how loud my daughter is when she's on the on her Xbox on a PlayStation so I'm going to tell her off in a minute. Um, yeah, just one final push to get you within grasp of those prizes. Because believe me, there is not a lot in it. It's all to play for still. Um, let me just see. So um, I also need to say a big thank you huge thank you to penny for everything she's done for offering to help for letting me talk her into doing it in the first place for her ideas and for her support you have been absolutely bloody phenomenal and um, it is very very much appreciated by me by everybody else couldn't do without you mate um so that is it from me on the video front i will be back on saturday no i won't because you will be watching this saturday and sunday what the f am i talking about i don't know and i've gone wrong i don't know what i'm talking about i will be back tomorrow so if you haven't already get your updated stats to me by midnight tonight it should now be sunday midnight tonight and then join us there will be a video on monday i will update where everybody is and then join us for the live over on calb sparkles at 8 p.m. BST Tuesday, be there or be square. Um, so thank you for joining me for this video. If you are brand new to this channel, welcome. Please do give the video a like. Help me get my name out there. Give me a thumbs up. Leave a comment below um, and click that subscribe button and help me grow my channel. And I will be back very soon with another video. It is, as always, over and out from this kitten up kitten. Bye bye.